the, these graceful facts are as follows. The United States Embassy has until now been permitted to maintain an aircraft in South Africa for the use of the ambassador on certain conditions in the execution of his official duties. This aircraft was converted for use as a spy plane by the installation of an aerial survey camera under the seat of the co-pilot. In flight, a device enabled the camera to take photographs of the earth below. Photographs in our possession reveal that the embassy aircraft was engaged in a systematic program of photography of vast areas of South Africa, including some of our most sensitive installations. The Foreign Minister has informed the United States Ambassador that in the light of the use to which the embassy aircraft has been put, the privilege of maintaining it in South Africa is summarily terminated. It is to be removed as soon as South African technicians can be satisfied that all photographic equipment has been removed from it to prevent further photography on its outward flight. The South African government has expressed its profound shock and dismay to the United States government at this reprehensible act by representatives of a country with which South Africa maintains diplomatic relations. I would add that I am bitterly distressed to learn how South African hospitality has been abused. 